What's rolling, brawlers? Reef Lahan here with all the cheese and your things. TCG back again with a Bakugan Pro Review here. Review one of the mythic Bakugan today. We got the mythic Payas Picatrix. And, um, yeah, uh, we've already reviewed a few of these, so we're gonna go ahead and just jump right into this awesome mythic review. Alright, brawlers, let's show you the character card. Oh, we got the Picatrix Double Magic Shield Mythic for the 500B 5 damage built in reroll. And then automatic show, you get to take away a core from your opponent's active Bakugan. Yeah, so very, very, very good um, core ability. Here is the mythic Picatrix. Very um, unclear, yeah, you can see it. This one actually shows up very well with my lighting and camera, so yeah. We'll put out some cores to show that. I don't think this thing can double core at all. I'm pretty sure it can't, um, but... You know, we can try to use the Neo use core method, I guess. Uh, one, two, three. Let's try to do that. One. Three, two, one. Bakugan Brawl. <laughs> I don't think it does, but yeah. There it goes. And I guess we can move without the Nepeans, of course, of this awesome Bakugan. Well, let's talk about the, uh, Obviously, the big thing in the room, um, Picatrix, 500B on top of the Magic Shield, it's going to be 1150, which is pretty decent, but, uh, the built-in reroll, so you know that if you decide to play chicken with that, it's a thing, but I don't suggest it, um, so when you do land on that Magic Shield, you are going to take a core away from your opponent's Bakugan, that being, um, uh, depends on what it is, really, I mean, if it's a core land Bakugan, you're going to hinder them, like, pretty well, so, so stuff like, um, Thrascal, Hydrus, Fennica, you know, stuff, Coraline and Bakugan will definitely get hindered by this, obviously, so, um, it's chaos, you know, it allows access to very good, powerful, strong core grabbing cards, so not only are you removing cores, you could obviously use Glaive, Consort, Mega Punch, and, you know, a plethora of other cards, um, you got plenty of draw power, like Stoic Shot, and this guy's Heme, and not only that, it gives access to the chaos, Nanogon, Siphon, allowing you to add on to the, you know, removing from your opponent's core and now since you have a magic shield you can add a core from the field that you either removed from your opponent or any other core that you see that's on the field so um you obviously have access to pyrus cards as well allowing you to play empower cards like chaotic flare crystal blaster focus fire spirit speed and a plethora of other ones you have access to the chaos adventus cards giving you you know the Baku Fetch, I forget what card it is, that lets you grab two cores, Baku Roll, I think is what it's called, um, and Moxified Combo Beam for B Reduction, and uh, not only that, you have access to, I guess, if you want the new Chaos and Lockless cards, which I don't really suggest, but some of them are decent, some of them are kind of, yeah, so, uh, Echo Search is pretty decent, so, you know, that's pretty good, other than that, I don't really see, you know, any cards to be used from that faction lineup, um, but, yeah, is this one of the better Mythic Bakugan that you've seen so far, um, you know, I personally think you should pick it up because 1150 is a very strong considering that if you're taking a core from your opponent's Bakugan, they're not going to be able to really do much unless they have a reroll, so, you know, that is a thing, so let me know your thoughts and opinions, of course, because these are just my own, like, comment, subscribe, make sure to follow my Instagram and Twitter for daily Bakugan content, and have the notification bell so you know when all the pro content is coming out, so with all that being said, guys, keep it rolling. And have a wonderful day.